little grocery haul this week. I actually haven't been properly shopping since before half term, so I needed to stock up on pretty much everything. I was so like, even Alistair had had school dinners today because I literally had no, nothing in for lunches. So um, yeah, I ended up spending £80.91, and pence, which is, I think is my biggest shop actually from Lidl, but I have got a lot here. So um, yeah, I went crazy on the fruit and veg, obviously. They've got so much in at the moment. It's so good value as well. Anyway, so I've got, um, I'll show you the hummus first. So we've got the classic hummus, the red pepper hummus, great for dipping. The kids love it as well. I got some of these tomatoes. These are like my favourite ones. They do actually, I think it comes with a sachet of um, olive oil as well, but generally these are really nice and sweet. So I like those. Got a cucumber. They were doing, or they always do, buy three of the sort of um, fun size range and get 25% off. So I got the snack tomatoes because the kids like these as well, just because they're all different colours and they do taste really nice as well. And then I got the peppers. I love them with hummus. And then I got the snack cucumbers. Again, these are great for um, packed lunches for school. I got some of the Pink Kids apples. I love Pink Lady apples. And um, these are like the perfect size for me and the children. They're not tiny. They're just nice. And a nice good size. Um, they brought in the donut peaches. I got so excited when I saw those. I think they're like 89p a pack. So yeah, I just need them to ripen up a little bit. Uh, we've got some British strawberries. Um, I decided to get the raspberries. Sometimes the, they do them in a smaller pack and they don't always look that nice, but I thought these look quite nice. Uh, bigger packs of blueberries are back, so I got those. They're about £2.30, I think, maybe £2.20. Um, I got the sweet corn coblets, chestnut mushrooms. I actually had porridge this morning and I've totally run out of dates, so I was feeling quite disappointed. And then I managed to find some uh, Tunisian dried dates. This packet, which is quite a reasonable size, was £1.60p or 69p, something like that. I do need to go to Costco because theirs are really good value as well and I just love them. Um, this is what I'm going to have for lunch. I don't usually, um, like, I don't know, I've never really picked up a lunch salad from there before apart from the sushi. But I think this is about £1.50 or something like that. But this is the spicy um, chicken and mango salad. It just sounded good to me and it's already done so that is going to be my lunch today i got the pineapple chunks again we got these last time the kids love those um for like pat lunches it's already diced stuff it's just easy and this packet was one pound 39 um it was kind of like on off i had like the orange label um we got some chili and garlic olives i fancied those and then we got some black just plain pitted ones as well some fair trade or organic bananas baby potatoes we've got one large avocado that needs ripening i've got a couple in my fridge that i can use up now so i thought i would just let that ripe um the cauliflower and broccoli florets uh just you know i just thought it's just easy and i can just you know cook them together um big pack of carrots i actually got these for free because they're, they're doing well they were doing those scratch cards like if you buy if you spend 25 pounds you get a scratch card and um yeah my freebie on my scratch card was a pack of carrots. So I got those for free. And then, so that's pretty much like the virgin fruit. And then I got some dairy stuff over here. We've got the cheese dippers. These are 79p, great for lunches. Got some strawberry Greek style yogurts for the children. They love those and I really like them as well. Um, I really fancy some feta. Um, and then I've got the prawn cocktail for Graham. That's one of his favorites. Some mozzarella for pizza. Uh, some of the probiotic sort of strawberry drinks, eight pack for just over a pound, I think these are. I've got another pot of the natural Greek style yogurt. This um, lasted me ages and the kids really like it as well. It's basically the same yogurt in there. Just It's just a natural one then you can just add stuff to it. Um, I've got a garlic and herb um, British chicken, just a roast in the bag one. And then I fancied doing fish this week and I wasn't too sure what I was gonna do. So I saw these and it was, uh, this, it's a sweet chili marinade, two um, fillets. And I just thought that sounded really, really good. And I think Graham will like that because it's not kind of like spicy chili, it's a sweet chili. And then I thought the kids could just have some codfish cakes. And then, yeah, we can have some like chips or whatever with it. See what I can find. 
So lastly, this is like random treat stuff and just some extras. So um, I got some of the seeded tortilla wraps. I asked the children what they wanted this week for like lunches and Violet was like adamant she wanted wraps. So um, yeah, I've got those in there. Yeah, the kids love those. Um, I've got some rye bread with sunflower seeds. I haven't had this before, as in like I haven't bought it from here and it's already sliced. So I'm gonna give that a go with like avocado or like eggs on toast, um, something a little bit different. Um, and they do do a plain one as well if you don't like the sunflower seeds. I got some cereal, I thought I'd go for just different than what we've been having. So I got some multigrain hoops and some fruit and fibre. I got two of these uh, single steam pouches, Mediterranean rice. They're basically just pop them in the microwave. I just thought it might be a good quick lunch uh, with some like, chicken breast or something. I got some soft apricots for snacks. Um, I got some pistachios, Graham loves those. Some pine nuts to add on to lunches and stuff, salads. Tomato puree to run out. Got some king prawns with chilli and coriander. Um, this is really nice, one of my favourites. And I basically get two lunches out of that and just add it to like a salad. Um, some honey um, cured ham slices. I got some chicken breast slices as well, just for like pat lunches. Um, and also we're gonna have pizza this week. So I've got some pepperoni and some of the ham can use for that. Um, I picked up two of these, these were 89p each. Some ham and cheese tortellini. I thought it's just a really quick sort of dinner. I could do a homemade cheese sauce or a tomato based sauce. Um, obviously with working in the evening, sometimes it's nice just to have something quick. Um, two lots of coconut water for a pound. We've run out of tomato ketchup and yeah, everyone seemed really happy with that. So that's good. It's really cheap as well. Um, so yeah, kitchen towels. And then I got two lots of these seashells, one pack for me and Graham, and then one pack for Graham's mum because it's her birthday this week. And I don't think she's tried these and they are so good and they're like, £2.19p or something per box. Yeah, they're a bit moreish. Uh, some dark chocolate rice cakes for Graham. I got three cookies for, for Graham and the children for a little treat tonight because I'm working. Um, some croissants. Um, I went for like different like um, pat lunch snacks if you like because we always go for the same thing and like after school snacks. So I got the croissants and then I also went for the caramel canyons um, and then also the mint chocolate rounds. They're about this big, I think, maybe smaller. So, yeah, that is pretty much my little grocery haul. Quite a large one this, this week. And also, they're doing Kids Go Free on... Um, like they've got, like, a voucher for, like, these places for Kids Go Free. So I thought I'd mention that because I picked one up. And they've got lots of really good offers. Oh, there we go. So you can cut that out and use that for over half term. You know, six weeks is coming up things that I left by my front door <laughs> so yeah I got two lots of roses which I thought were really really pretty and then we got some wholemeal seeded loaf which is the one that we all really like it toasts nicely as well and then I got some cheese puffs which is a 10 pack the things that I can't get in Lidl I got uh, some coconut almond milk these are actually on offer all of the L pros are on offer so coconut almond milk is one of my favorites and I thought I'd go for hazelnut just for something different I really like having these as my milk in my Nespresso coffee. Also for porridge and just uh, general like um, breakfast is when I mainly use it for. Um, I got some more Method. Um, this is a new new scent that I've never seen before. The Method's all on offer, all of their range. This one was two pounds instead of three pounds, so I thought I'd stock up because I'm halfway through the one. It's a multi-surface uh, spray if you didn't know. Uh, and then also, Graham absolutely loves Skinny Cow, these things. I don't really like mint ice cream. Um, but they had these on offer, two for three pounds. Um, and I saw these and they were new and they are right up my street. These sort of like, um, like sandwich biscuits sort of with ice cream in the middle. So I got those as well, just as a little treat. Quick meal plan for the week. So yeah, today is actually Tuesday. So we had uh, Graham's burgers yesterday. But tonight I'm going to do bangers and mash with broccoli. Uh, Graham's actually going to be doing that. Uh, we're going to do homemade pizza one night with corn on the cob. I'm going to do the roast chicken. I'll probably do the roast chicken tomorrow actually. And have that with like a large side salad with some like uh, rice on the side as well. Just to add, in, add in the carb. Uh, spaghetti bolognese because the kids are just on and on about it. And I usually put spinach and mushrooms in it as well. Um, and then we're going to have fish maybe on the Friday or the Thursday and do the baby new potatoes with veg so yeah quite an easy sort of 
box standard meal plan for this week.